very like a very fragile girl, it's very sensitive. The hair are very clean, pure, with little fluffy and very delicate, kind of girly and very fragile. It's all about very fresh, natural, beautiful, poetic girls. And we've given the girls small amounts of foundation on their face and tiny bits of white foundation, concealer, a little bit of uh, transparent white paint around the eyes and on the cheekbones. So we're lightening, it's all about light and shade, all about structure but very softly and kind of poetically applied. Why don't you come with me, little girl, on a magic carpet ride? Well, you don't know what we can see. Why don't you tell your dreams to me? Fantasy will set you free. Close your eyes, girl. Look inside the Let the sound take you away. It's about red carpet dressing in a Victor and Rolf way. It means that uh, the entire collection is executed in red carpet and it is shown on a red carpet. I am so thankful that I get to open the show. I mean, my first opening, I guess you could say, in Paris. So, big deal. And I'm happy it's Victor and Rolf. <laughs> It really is red carpet, uh, so it was very challenging to make clothes out of carpet. But for us it's really a contemporary obsession. Because we're, we're all so obsessed with the red carpet and celebrity and we felt we wanted to take a look at it in a different way. Honestly, it makes me feel like one big present. <laughs> like, look at the bow. It's cute, right? Like a bonbon. I'm like ready to unwrap myself. Like, it's so funny. I love it. I really do. I love the color, for one. Um, I love how it's so unexpected and incredible. Um, yeah, I love it. It's so comfy. We treated it in several ways. We used the carpet as is, but we also worked with a manufacturer to make the backing of the carpet softer, like take away the rubber. And um, of course, you can also think about it as a very heavy velvet or a short pile fur. There is a series of looks all over in carpet, very much based on shape and they look as if they have been uh, put together in a very spontaneous way. So they're wrapped, they're draped, they're knotted. And then there's a group of uh, dresses that have um, an animal artwork. It looks like the carpet has been shaved, but in reality it's all uh, hand uh, applications. I love that it fits so well. I mean, it's perfect like a glove and it makes you feel really powerful. And I like the color, I love red. They turned it into beautiful dresses, like there were things there that I, I would wear, a lot of people would wear, and so maybe it is turning, also turning that idea of haute couture on its head. As always with Victor and Roth, they have their kind of tongue-in-cheek and kind of commentary on social 
in norms, as it were. I mean, we could look into this and imagine maybe this is some sort of a comment on all of the free uh, clothing that are given to celebrities worn on the red carpet. Um, maybe it's the, you know, emperor's clothes commentary as well. Um, you know, you could, you could read a lot into it, and that's what I love about a Victor Noir show. You don't take it au premier degré. There's a lot more going into it than just, you know, clothing that you would, you know, want to wear. I really like the bow and I like the fact that it's more open like compared with the other girls. You can see the shoulders and like looks really elegant I would say. More like evening for the red carpet. <laughs> For us, it's not uh, intended to be judgmental, and it's also a, a formal exercise. How do you treat uh, an atypical material and uh, turn it into clothing, and hopefully elegant clothing? The music is music students who are clapping, like applauding as if people come on the red carpet and the clapping becomes a music piece, so it becomes a rhythm. With the mechanical clapping, it sort of felt like maybe they were poking fun a little bit at the ceremony and the pomp of, of celebrity culture and how we worship these people on the red carpet. Um, but, you know, it, it's also a really interesting way to end the Haute Couture Week that they're looking at using one material and a material that isn't luxurious. You know, it almost looked like toweling from afar. <laughs>